Good luck. Uh, sure. Why not? This will be fun. Hmm. Oh, let's check.
Thanks for the game. Can I end it on a loss? I don't know. That was pretty intense. That was super intense. Poor Killer Ducky. It's a very rough tournament. It's difficult to win. But, you know, this is the anniversary tournament. It's somewhat prestigious, isn't it? In case I don't quickly get a pairing, I might as well say something. Some sort of closing remark. Yeah, so... Uh, I'm still quite impressed the site exists. Uh, I know that Lee Chess is still maturing and moving forward to newer versions of libraries. And as it does, it's becoming easier and easier for copies of Lee Chess to show up where you could play games like checkers or other board games, strategy games that are turn-based. Um, so yeah, now we have Shogi. And it's, the site's been around two years. I was really surprised when it first showed up. Um, and I'm quite impressed by the work that its lead developer has done, bodging things together to make sure the site works well. And yeah, I hope in the future the site will continue to do well. At first, I thought the best feature of the site was the ability to collaboratively study games with other players. I wasn't particularly astounded that another play zone exists when 81 Dojo already does quite well. Good luck. Um, but yeah, uh, this is a good site as well. I've made numerous code contributions that have yet to be reviewed. Um, but give it time, we'll see how uh, the site continues to grow. Hmm. <laughs> ah, we got spoilers. Well, it would be an opponent who hasn't won all their games, if I had to guess. Just looking at these first few moves. That's my kind of intuition here. It's, I'm not under as severe pressure as I was in the previous game. Um, okay. Yeah, I know who this is. Mm-hmm. Sure. I know who this is. That's fine. <laughs> At least I think I know. Someone who quickly plays to maintain an advantage on the clock, playing something that's familiar and that I've seen them play before. That's fine. Then you get to this position, and you're like, well, crap, now what? How do you attack once you've played this shape? And sometimes I've had some very nice attacks against this castle. Um, okay, maybe I hung this pawn. I'm not sure. Maybe it's hanging. Let's attack from my castle, just for some fun. 
I mean, just because the rating system says I'm favored over this opponent doesn't mean that I'm like a heavy favorite or anything. That's not how Shogi works. Um, so my secret sauce here is that this file is one easy place, well, comparatively easy place to attack when they play this. It continues to be a target that on its head is not easy to defend. So even if everything else goes to shit, I've always got a target on this file. I was debating bringing the silver up the rook over to try something really complicated, but it doesn't seem useful or necessary to do so. Um, rather, we put the rook somewhere safe, protect this point. This again. Okay. Very well. Um, sure, let's try this. So this is a target, then that makes this a target, and once that moves, this is the target. So... Yeah, they do have a counterattack on the left. Or they have, <laughs> I call it a counterattack, but they attacked first. They do have an attack on that side of the board. But what does it do? There's nothing going on over here. Interesting. All right. Sure. They'll endeavor to keep this file closed, but my bishop and silver have something else in mind. I'm debating, like, allowing a bishop exchange here and dropping or hanging my silver completely. Gold takes and I promote and I'm hitting another silver. Seems risky, but... Um, it's kind of wild that I can even contemplate that. Also, I have a pawn in hand. I should have done this. Should have done that. And then they would have moved their knight, and who knows where we'd be now. But that would have been a lot safer than what I just did. What I did gives them a free tempo to hit me. Uh-huh. So they're aiming at my knight here. Um, on principle, I can't let that stand. <sighs> hmm. All right, plan B. I really wanted to promote my rook on the center file, because that's what I've done in previous games. That ain't happening today. Let's take a different file. Now they're going to bring the knight out. And the reason they're going to do... oh, never mind. The reason I thought they were going to do that is because these are all really nice targets. Um, but, no. We could do it this way. I could also drop a pawn here and try to promote right next to there. Um, that doesn't seem helpful. Or rather, I need to make a space for this bishop. So, I'll make space for the bishop. In the event that the opponent uses the knight, I can just run. I guess, incidentally, that defends this pawn, but that wasn't really my goal. Pretty 
probably I'm going to get in deep trouble soon. Because my position's not solid. But yeah, I have a better chance this game than the last game. But it's... It's maybe somewhat better than a coin toss, but I wouldn't put myself as a heavy favorite on this one. My opponent studies harder than I do. Alright, there's the night move. That hits this. I didn't see that, but I think it's fine. If I promote here, or rather if I move here, that blocks the rook. Um, I could take a lance also. Why don't I take a lance? I should take a gold first and then take the lance. That's a mess. Yeah, let's take... Also, I could park the gold here to, like, well, I don't know, it's not a good idea. I need the gold to checkmate later. I don't like the fact that my king is so exposed here. Uh, but it's all relative. Uh, so I always push this. Well, you know, why break with tradition now? Let's do it. They can hit my bishop. And we just take and take. So let's not go there. Um, yes, yeah, so now I've got a nice clean attack on the third file. I could push and hit the knight. Let's do it. I don't see the defect here. I'm keeping this rook away from my king for fear that something terrible might happen. But yeah, also the knight drop here, hitting that could be kind of nice. But yeah, everybody expects an attack on the edge file against this castle. And I think file three, there's a lot of potential here. It's just, there's so many ways to attack this that the opponent can't easily account for unless they've got pawns blocking this. But each time, it takes them a, a tempo to get a pawn down here. And I can just drop another pawn and force it back up, so... It's not trivial to defend this third file attack. So they're probably considering taking here or something, or I don't know. I don't see how they can... I mean, a pawn drop on three, seven, or file seven somewhere wouldn't be out of the question. Also, exchanging bishops wouldn't be out of the question, but I might drop it here. Um, Alright, that's aggressive. Sure. Uh, I could take that. I don't have to take it. What's the plan? Uh, 
I don't know. All right, let's take it. And then I can kick the horse away, although the horse might take there next. Um, all right, let's defend the weakness and attack this at the same time. Fair enough. That is a promoted knight. Um, not sure what that does for you. All right, let's see where this ends up then. You're the one who started this. Admittedly, giving a gold to the Anaguma Castle is not the smartest strategy ever. I could maybe have pushed the pawn instead, but I don't think it has the same impact. Yeah, let's do it. Maybe I'm playing with too much fire here. As I tend to do. Wow. 
Hello. Okay. Thanks for the game. All right. Yep. Yeah, it makes sense to be in a panic state toward the end of the game like that. There's, it's a difficult game to play. Um, so that was an exciting game. Nothing against my opponent there. Uh, I have my own weaknesses. They have theirs. I've seen enough of their games to have some idea how they play and how to try to exploit it. That said, I should work on my own weaknesses and correcting those. That's why we play games to learn and to do better the next time. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah, I imagine so. That doesn't surprise me. These are Blitz games. I make ridiculous blunders. And, yep, I did take the audience request. I even played one more game than I expected. 
but yeah, I couldn't end on a loss. It was good fun. Uh, best wishes to everybody in the coming year, and who knows, we might have another anniversary tournament next year. That could be good fun. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.